What's up guys, welcome back to the video you guys and today's video we're doing a story time video. Um This is the time I actually had an asthma attack and I don't remember it too slimy, so I'ma go ahead and give you guys a little shoddy on the potty right there because you know, why not? Anyways um This is my full video and entirely truth. I swear to god this is everything I remember for about seven eight years ago I don't know maybe it was longer ago maybe it was a little bit before um I don't know anyways you guys know and if you guys don't know already about my shortness of breath all the time in my commentary videos I do have asthma uh, it's actually really bad asthma no cap I'm not a fucking fat dude just in case anybody's wondering oh, why the fuck is this guy fucking fucking uh fucking weasel he's in his fucking videos I fucking take very long fucking breaths it's because I've actually have asthma and I have really bad asthma and my lungs sometimes can be really bad and uh that's why I take my healer. I try to take my healer every day. Yeah, I'm not a fucking fat dude. I work out every day. I'm not a fucking fat dude. Just in case anybody was wondering that, I'm just saying, okay? Okay. Okay, anyways, guys, get into the video. Hold on, let me just have one of these fucking pineapples. And this shit's free as fuck. Have your snacks, guys, right now. Okay, anyways, guys. This was probably in 20, 2013 or 2012, I don't exactly remember it. It was about the same time when I started my first ever YouTube channel around there. And when I actually did this um, video, not did this video, but when I actually got asthma, you're probably wondering, you know, people get asthma at a certain time, or some people were even born with it, but just don't experience it until a longer time in their life. I actually was born with asthma, I always, I always had asthma, I mean... I mean, I always literally did have, have asthma. I was a guy that I known about my asthma when I was fucking two years old. But I really had always had asthma. I mean, I don't really rarely have asthma attacks now. I, actually, I don't at all have asthma attacks now at all. But the last time I had an asthma attack was a long, long, long time ago. Now, I'm not sure if it was an asthma attack, but I didn't die, okay? I just kissed anybody wanted. I didn't fucking, I didn't fucking fall on the ground, have a seizure while I was having an asthma attack. Or however asthma attacks work. I don't know if this was exactly how an asthma attack worked in my sense, but I'm gonna put it out as this. So basically, I had an asthma something. My asthma caused something. I don't think it was an asthma attack, but it was basically an asthma attack. Since it attacked something in my body, so it was basically an asthma attack, right? Like a heart attack. Heart attack could be something if it attacks something in your body, just how it attacks you the fucking the best. Okay, I'm not doing this shit. There's probably eight girls watching my, my fucking video right now. They probably have no fucking clue what I'm saying right now, so. Yeah. And it was, it was early 2014, maybe around break time. Uh, I had an asthma attack. I'm gonna call that. I'm not sure what it was, but I pretty sure I have an asthma attack. I basically just yeah, I couldn't really breathe at all, and this used to always happen. I used to fucking take really long breaths. One time I went to school, my guy, and I was fucking taking the longest breaths ever. Cause I swear to God, my lungs were hurting like he fucking can never hurt before in his whole goddamn life. I mean. People without asthma, be fucking lucky, my dude. You don't have to take big ass fucking breaths, and you don't have to, and you don't have to watch out what the fuck you're, uh, what, what, what you're doing. Like, like for example, I have to watch how fucking, fucking fast I walk, how fast I run, uh, how much I work out, just because that can sometimes cause an asthma attack by itself. I mean, you can have an asthma attack out of the blue. You don't even need to be really doing nothing. You just need to have a lot of adrenaline, and you just need to be doing a lot of shit at the same exact time. Just doing a lot of shit, right? So I personally had the worst asthma in my family. Nobody had as bad asthma as me. I can't name one person that I actually know in my family. Even if it was my fucking fellow grandparents, great great grandparents, fucking great 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 great, great, great grandparents. As far as I know, I had the worst asthma. Okay. Now I was hospitalized at this point. Now, so basically, let me just talk about this real quick. I had the worst asthma in my family. My little brother has the third worst asthma. No, my little brother's the second. My big, my older brother, which at the time was probably around my age or some shit like that, right? Um. So basically, yes. Let's just, okay. Yeah. Um. I don't know what the hell I'm saying right now. So basically, yes. My brother has asthma, but he doesn't have asthma as bad as me. Is what I'm trying to say. 
So that's how I know I have the worst asthma in the family. I mean, my asthma is so bad to the point where I literally just lose my fucking breath. I mean, it's crazy how asthma works. It really is. Uh, so, okay, anyway, if people wonder why I sometimes take very long breaths and forget what I'm saying, it's usually because of my asthma and I can't really remember because I do have short-term memory loss. It's not as bad as an old fucking grandma, but it's getting there, okay? But, uh, yeah, um, I'm also halfway blind. I'll be talking about that story the next time. Uh, but first of all, um, so yeah, basically when I had an asthma attack, I went to the doctor. I'm not sure how fucking far. It wasn't anything too urgent. I mean, I just couldn't really breathe. Um, that was it basically. And, uh, yeah, I was took in there. I threw up a couple times. I don't know how that was possible. I just threw up. I mean, I sometimes get very sick feelings. I just throw up, right? Uh, yeah, so anyways, um, I threw up on that day, maybe around six to five times, maybe slightly less or slightly more. Anyways, it was really fucking hot in this, bro. I swear to God, the fucking nurse is so hot, bro. I swear to God. Okay, stop. Just stop. Just stop. I mean, she literally was a fucking beauty in the beast, bro. Now, she was the beauty. I was the beast, my guy. You guys know what I'm saying? You guys know what I'm saying? Okay, anyway, yeah, she was so fucking beautiful, bro. I didn't have any interactions since I was still fucking a virgin at that time. Uh, I mean, I literally did not even fucking, I don't know, I literally didn't even have pubes yet. Like, I swear to God, I was still a fucking virgin at that time. But I'm not even joking to my highest note. I was a fucking little string cheese fucking virgin. Okay, I swear to motherfucking God, I was still a fucking virgin. Anyways, guys, getting back to the fucking video, I basically stayed three days over there with my mom. I didn't really go to sleep too much just because the doctor fucking office was literally really shitty. It was a really big bedroom, though. I ain't gonna lie. I was hospitalized. I got fucking whatever I wanted. The bedroom looked really shitty, but everything else was cool. And that's on the very day when I had one of my first ever Legos ever, too. And uh, I don't really care about Legos anymore, really. Those had Legos, Legos what the hell? I don't even care about them, but anyway, just talk about that. So, yeah, basically, I kind of like, literally had an asthma attack. Uh, they brained me a Wii U at the time Wii U was popping. Um, and I actually was playing it the whole day almost. And then. Around the time about that, I actually, we actually got out the office about three days later. I stole a fucking Lego, and damn that hot ass nurse broke. She gave me the heebie-jeebies up in there. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, okay. Uh, you know, yeah. Just also, it's a very embarrassing story too. My fucking doctor one time. I don't really feel like we'll talk about that. Episode like a 17 likes, bro. I has to be. It has to be. It has to. Okay, fucking has to. It really does. So yeah, I mean honestly. I don't know what to say because people don't really understand how bad asthma is. People could just literally fucking say, oh, asthma is so easy to deal with. It's very common, too. That's the thing that worries me. It's very common. I mean, it's not something that happens occasionally, though. It's something that happens commonly. Not occasionally, but commonly, right? So it's something that could happen to you. You could be born right now and you could have it, you know? It's really just, um, it depends on the factor of how healthy you are and how good you came out when you were a baby, right? I mean, you guys can never learn. You guys can never learn the deliciousness of where you were actually born. I mean, nobody can ever do that. Anyways, that's it for the video. If you guys want to see part two, uh, there's really not really a part two, but it's kind of a part two. Uh, get this to five likes, five likes. I swear, that's all I'm asking. Be a part two, like a seven, seven, eight, seven, eight minute video. And anyway, guys, peace. Love you guys. Maybe fuck like three minutes, not eight videos. And anyways, peace. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'll fuck your nerves in the ass if this video gets ten thousand likes. Bye.